And in those days following that loss, how, how, what was in that? those days following the, the title game loss, how, how often were you thinking of replaying the game? I mean, was it easy to... Move on. Uh, I was replaying it a lot, you know, just like I said, just because I could have scored and, and I th believe we could have won. But uh, you know, like I said, well, we just been focusing a lot on just the season period. But I mean, you can't not think about this game and, and, and have a little, little, little feeling about it from last year. You know, so. I mean, that's what inspired you guys' wristbands. Oh well, yeah, you are right about that. So. Yeah, I still got it. Yeah, I still got it. Yeah, a lot of coaches do too still. How often? I mean, do you glance at it daily? Yeah, I, I look at it. I don't take it off. So I, I keep them both on and I just wear it. I look at it. I look at it before every game too just to see that the finish part, just to play every game like that, just to finish every play. So. And even when you're in class, do you look down? Like what? Uh, sometimes, sometimes, especially this week. <laughs> Who came up with the idea for those? Uh, I think it was uh, Will Richards. I think his dad made them for everybody. I think that's who was handing them out. Now, is that directly tied to the Big 12 champion? I mean, it you know, all sends one second. Yeah. I, I mean, is it tied directly to that, or is there more to it than just Yeah, that? I, I would think that would. I mean, I think that was the point of it, I think. So, I mean, that's the only thing I would think of. Were you hoping that maybe Texas would be ranked and, and all that, all the hype coming into this game and instead they've lost two straight coming in. Does that kind of take some of the luster off it or not really? Oh, no, I don't think it matters. It's still Texas. I mean, they ain't lost two, like you said, and they're going to be coming here ready to play and get a win, especially against us. So that doesn't matter at all to me. When you're watching the film of those two losses, do you see a, a weakness that you guys can exploit? Uh, Not really. I mean, I think they're a good football team. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they showed that last year, and I mean, they're still showing it this year, but I think they're a great football team still. So, what kind of talk about their secondary? Uh, there, there's some good, fast guys back there. Good, fast guys. Uh, I think we have physical guys though on the offensive side as receivers. So, I mean, we're gonna see. We need to compare them to what you face every day in practice, athletic and speed wise. How would you say Texas matches up with the secondary? I think our secondary is the best that like we go against every day. I don't think there's no one's better than that. So, I mean, we prepare ourselves through spring and fall camp with these guys. So. I don't think it's no, 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 no. I mean, no competition. So, have the coaches been trying to downplay the whole Texas thing, or are they using me as a as a motivator? Oh, we just going in and just and just and just uh, a scout like we do every week. So it's no difference, and they act in the same way, and, and we we should do the same. You know, it's just another game, and I mean, we're gonna go out, think about ourselves, and it's about us anyway. At the, at the end of the day, you know, putting our work on film and just playing hard, finishing. What's the attitude like in the locker room? Uh, I think it's I think it's pretty mellow. It's, it's pretty the same. I mean, it's no different. I mean, we know it's Texas, and we know we got to do to win. So I don't think nothing has changed really. I mean, we all know we got to do so. Is it realistic to treat this like any other game? I mean, you got the wristbands around your wrist and everything about the one second. I mean. There's got to be a little extra motivation for this. Game. <laughs> I mean, I guess you could say a tad, but I mean, like I said, it's just, it's just another game. I and mean, we're just going to come out and execute like we should. I mean, we're not going to come out and play this game harder than any other. So we got to play them the exact same to win them all. So. Hey, Brandon, you made a little bit of a reference out in the hallway before you came in just, just about this being, you know, the last year for the conference and, and going out. I mean, among the players, is you know, the fact that Nebraska's going Big 12 to Big 10, is that how much of an issue is that as you make your guys' last go around through the league here? Because uh, we just want to go out with a bang. But at the same time, uh, the conference thing—I don't think it does. I don't think it matters at all because we just play football. You know, it doesn't matter who we're playing against, and we feel like we should dominate any of the opponents. But uh, I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't think it's really that big of an issue, really. But I think, I mean, coming into the season, that we got a target on our back just because we're leaving, and, and, and a lot of people are upset about that. But like I said, we're just gonna come out and play every game the same. I mean, beyond the fact that you know there's the so-called revenge thing from last year's title game. I mean, this is probably the last time Nebraska will play Texas uh, uh, for the foreseeable future. Uh, you know, does that add much to it? It's the last time. Uh, no, not really. I didn't even, I didn't even want to really thought that far into it like that. So I didn't even really, you know, think about that. So, I mean, like I said, we're just going to go in and, and play this game. So, just like any other. Do you think Texas is going to force maybe Taylor to throw the ball a little bit more? So is, is this an opportunity for you guys to kind of step up <clears> as a receiving core, you think, this game? No, I think so. I think so. I mean, we're going to see what we, what we game plan. And, and if, if, if we run the ball still, we're just going to keep blocking and, and we're going to go from there. So.
How good is their secondary? Uh, it's a pretty good guy, I think. It's a pretty good fast guy, very fast guy. But like I said, I think we're a physical group, and we're just going to see how that's going to play out. How, how did they play these guys last week? Uh... I mean, I don't know. My players are. I mean, I think we still, I think we still made big plays. But I mean, uh, if we open up the pass, we're gonna see how good they are.